A number of staff at the court registrar's office have been categorized as persons of interest and the national and supreme courts will only attend to urgent matters. During this temporary closure, all staff are urged to be vaccinated. The partial lockdown comes into effect today and will continue until the 26th of October. While this will not affect the Supreme Court sitting, which commences on the 25th of October, the court premises will undergo a deep cleansing and full sanitation of the court facilities. COVID-19 continues to affect court proceedings at both the national and Supreme Courts. As per an internal memorandum issued to NJSS staff by Chief Justice A. Gibbs Salika on the 29th of September, all staff are now required to get vaccinated during this partial lockdown. In the secular release today, NJSS Secretary Jack Carrico said starting next Tuesday, when the partial lockdown is lifted, everyone who works at the courthouse will need to show their vaccination cards before they are allowed into the court premises. For those who are not vaccinated, they will be required to show a negative PCR test result before resuming duties. This applies to all NJSS staff, lawyers, court users, including members of the mainstream media. Meanwhile, court cases at the Waigani Comital Court will continue under strict COVID-19 measures. Tekla Gunga, National MTV News.